Hey Internet, I'm Colorful Arnie, and welcome back to Frogger. He's back. We're on the second to the last world, the Cactus World, and we're starting off with Cactus Point. This world is really hard, but it's also a lot more awesome than the sewer world, so I welcome this change of pace. To start, we're gonna hop over here. And eat, uh, but, oh, that's it? Really? That's it? Oh, lame. So we've got this buffalo stampede that we have to get past, and it can be very difficult. Darn it! They move at different speeds as well, which makes it quite a bit more difficult than it should be. Alright, let's go over here. Touching any of the cacti will result in death. However, the butterflies offer some points, so make sure to eat those. Oh, darn it. I didn't expect the rattlesnakes to uh, turn around that fast. I hate not being able to see anything. Watch out for the falling boulders, because even when they're exploding, they can still hurt you. Ow. That second to last row of buffalo, they just like never stop coming. Five thousand points? That automatically changed the camera for me. Then we've got these little salamanders or geckos. Not really sure what they're supposed to be. All I know is that they kill you if you touch them. They can also move on those rocks when you cannot. Ah, whoa. That was a bit too close, but we got the blue frog. Excellent. Now we have the fun of avoiding boulders while walking down this canyon area. And there's the orange frog. Alright, you might be wondering where the green frog is. He's very close to the start, but you have to travel a long distance in order to get to him, if that makes sense. Darn it. Pelican moved. Well, that's like the worst aim ever. And we get a nice scenic view of the world below. And now we can hop off and get the green frog. And now we get to go to Boulder Alley, which is one of the most annoying levels in the game. Also, a level where you absolutely need Super Hop. Specifically, to get over these beetles. Oh, you are kidding me. Alright, back to Boulder Alley. Plen there are plenty of bugs to eat on this level. Unfortunately, the frogs are in very annoying locations. Red here is one of the easiest, though. Also, if you're feeling a little risky... So I'm going to try to get this frog first, and you definitely want to change your view. Yeah, you just have to hope that those two things line up perfectly. Very, very irritating. Alright, 
Nope. Not doing that again. All right. No! Uh, Should have changed the view, but I didn't want to uh, change the view only to see a beetle running right at me and giving me no time to super hop. I jumped too far. Darn it. The frog I'm trying to get is the hardest frog to get on the level. A little too hard in my personal opinion. Actually, I'm going to do this. Those beetles come at you faster than the other beetles. Alright. Now the real fun begins. This is why they call it Boulder Alley. Nope. No! Almost killed me. And you'll see there's a nice little pelican here. And he's willing... Wait, what?! What?! I jumped on its back! Oh, that's a bunch of baloney. What? What? I jumped on its back. And I don't even like baloney. Darn it! I hate having to go through that part. Darn it. There are too many beetles on this level. Alright, let's try this again. And this time, it better actually let me jump on the pelican's back. No! Not again! Oh, the freaking super hop! <sighs> I was trying to eat the bug. I should not have done that. That was way too risky. I thought there were bugs down there, though. Alright, I'm gonna go this way, because I'm fairly confident I won't die if I go this way. There! Can we give it a one-up? Thank you. This level's even harder than I remember it. No! I should have super hopped over that. Guess we're getting the blue frog. Alright! There's Blue Frog. And thankfully we get the one-up we need. Nope, not even risking that. I 
should not have done that. It should have stopped taking risks. No, no! Freaking boulders! Oh boy. I hate Boulder Alley. This level also has a bit of luck involved with the beetle formations. Alright, my finger is off of the super hot button. Alright. Wow, that's a really picky pelican. But we finally get the orange frog. Unfortunately, that's not the end of the level yet. Because we still have to get purple frog. Who I personally thought was harder than orange frog, but maybe I'm wrong. Nope. Nope and out of there. Boing. Boing. Thankfully, the boulders always come down in the same formation. It's very nice. Finger off the super hop button. We just have to climb to the top of this. Easier said than done. Especially since the camera angle purposefully gets really weird. There! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! We beat Boulder Alley and now we can go to Tumbling Valley. Good bit easier, but I'm definitely going to die on this level. It's home to the tumbleweeds, which make the weirdest sound effect in the game. Not that. What the heck? They look like shadows. Yep, that's the sound effect. This level needs even more luck on the beetle formations than Boulder Alley, though. Thankfully, the tumbleweeds move in a very predict predictable pattern. You just don't have to be stupid. Whew, I got lucky with that beetle pattern. If you don't get a large enough gap for that corner, you're just, you're dead. You also have to watch out for the vultures. And there's Red Frog. He's easy. Orange Frog, on the other hand, is a right pain in the keister. Tumbleweeds. Yeah, nope, backing off. Nope, darn it, I was stuck! No matter where I went, I would have died. Even if I went to the left, those tumbleweeds would have hit me. I can't believe I got that. <laughs> but, can't relax just yet. <laughs> So let me tell you what those vultures can catch you off guard. Thankfully, I, uh, there are one-ups in those craters. Alright. Nope. Nope. Sometimes being uh, patient, waiting for the tumbleweeds to go in the right areas, can help you on this stage. Time to get Purple Frog. Well, crud, that's not good. Now I don't think I can get Purple Frog. 
No, I can't. Lovely. At least we got to see that graphic death. Yeah, right there. You've got to just pray the vultures aren't in your way. Well, darn it, I've got one shot. One shot. I'm trying to see, where are the safe points? Yes! Tumbling Valley is done, and I didn't have a game over. Alright, that's going to do it for this episode, because I really don't feel like doing this next level just yet. So... I'm Color Flaherty, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you for the next episode. Have a great day, and God bless.